Hey, the summer concert season is pretty much here, and there's nothing better than enjoying our beautiful weather with some amazing live music. Yes, there is a one-of-a-kind venue right here in Grand Rapids. It offers all of that in an intimate downtown setting. Their lineup is out for the season, and it is pretty impressive. We are talking about the Listening Lawn at Studio Park with Quinn Matthews. He is the Director of Music and Programming. Quinn, thanks for being here. Yeah, thanks for having me, as always. Yeah, yeah so let's talk about the venue first yeah. and talk about you know <clears throat> what people can expect when they come to see a show. Yeah, it's so cool because it's right in the smack of downtown Grand Rapids, you know, and we have this outdoor piazza that we call it. So it's surrounded by buildings. So your audio and your sound and, and where you are is kind of contained in this one little area, but it can fit five, six, sometimes seven, eight hundred people out there. Yeah, all really? standing room. Okay. Um, so we had some big shows in the past and we thought this year, let's let's bring it all in. And yeah, there's a good shot. Right there. That's, that's yeah. a great shot of what it'll look like. Yeah, so yeah. It's, it's been a blast these past couple of years. Uh, so this year we're super pumped to get going again. Yeah. So this is an outdoor venue. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty much standing room, right? Other yeah, yeah. Some, we do some, some premium seats. seating for right. some of the shows, but most of them standing room. Yeah, well, yeah. That, there and there, right? there's the name. Yeah. Spoiler. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah spoiler alert. <laughs> there's it, yeah. some names coming. Yeah, super pump. KT Tunstall, that's up there. Mayor Wine. All these artists. Um, you know, big time artists. Robert Randolph, as you see there. Uh, last year we had Indigo Girls, and that was sort of our biggest one. It was sort of our test of like, can we handle like a big kind of show? And we realized we, it was our most successful one in terms of attendance and just how we pulled it off and everything. So this year, that's kind of what we went for for all of them. We got Spin Doctors out there and uh, just, a, just a lot of different variety, as I always like to do out there, yeah. yeah. Spin Doctors, I got to think of yeah. I, uh... <laughs> Yeah, I, You'll know all of them. I got two princes yeah. in my head now. Yeah, Little Miss Can't Be right? Wrong. Little Miss Can't Oh yeah. my gosh, yes, yes. those songs. Um, <laughs> yeah. And Lone Bellow also really Fantastic. great. Fantastic, yeah. yeah, for sure. Yeah, they were at St. Cecilia maybe a year or two ago. Uh, super cool folk act that uh, uh, is really well known, so we're pumped to have them out there as well. So, yeah. So that's the lineup. Mm -hmm. Who are you excited to see? Well, I was just joking around with you right. guys about this Victor Wooten, who he's this amazing virtuoso bass player. He played with Bela Fleck and the Flecktones, which okay. was this cool like bluegrass jazz combined kind of thing. And he's he's like the I'm telling you, like you can't go wrong watching this guy work. And the Wooten brothers, they're it's his whole family, and they're all like virtuoso. You sold me. I gotta see it now. And I believe yeah. Bela Fleck. Yeah, 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 you'll you'll know. Um, but yeah, you know, Spin Doctors are gonna be so fun. The Wood Brothers are killer and it's probably one of the first that'll sell out they've played Meyer Gardens the past couple years and we're a smaller venue than that we don't sure. even hold as much as that so um, that one's going fast good great kind of folk uh, act uh, mayor line KT Tunstall had a bunch of hits in the early 2000s too we all know those songs so was, um, was KT Tunstall no, I was thinking of Nana Cherry. I was thinking of Black Horse Cherry. Yeah, no, that's it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember the songs that I associate with these artists. <laughs> that's a good song too. Yeah, yeah, it is a really good song. A lot of like people that come to these shows, even if they don't exactly know who it is, like once someone starts playing, like, oh yeah, I know that song. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> so, well, and you're guaranteed good music. Yes, and a I great promise. Venue, right? We never book a bad show. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> and then we're talking an outdoor venue, so. Two questions. Yeah. One, rain. Yep. Okay, talk There's about. There's no rain. <laughs> we don't have rain. What are you talking about? Yeah. What, are you talking what about? happens? What happens? And then, and yeah. all the things. I mean, this is a great launching pad for all the things that are happening downtown. Totally. Yeah. No, I appreciate that. And we do call them rain or shine events. I mean, we've had to cancel or switch to indoors and kind of pivot it last minute. But it is the the stage part is covered. The artists are are safe from from water, and we only have to postpone or change of lightning and things like that. Okay. So sometimes, I mean, the Crane Wise played a few years ago. It was like insane downpour, and we all were like, this was the coolest concert ever. Wow. We're just so, it's like Woodstock or whatever. You're just right? getting soaking wet and everything. And I appreciate you mentioning downtown. There's just so much cool stuff that continues to pop up. Restaurants, bars, outdoor stuff, art, what DGRI does and everything. And, and we're kind of right in the center of that um, with around Van Andel and alleyways. And, and just, I appreciate you saying it. It's like, come downtown, come hang out, walk around come see a show, go to a movie, like, we're hanging out down there. Hey, downtown, going on. Yeah, downtown yeah. GR is the best. Right? It's yeah. the hang. Absolutely it's love hang. it. Yeah. And you guys are, still have stuff going on in the listening room, too. Appreciate you saying that. Okay. Yep, inside, we continue throughout the summer as well. And that's where you actually get tickets to this as well, so we don't change anything up like a different website, so it's same. And, of course, we're Midtown now, so you go to oh, the, the Midtown. I know, we still say it. <laughs> sorry. 
sorry. I, <laughs> the I know thing that. is, is it's a listening room, so yes. we still call it listening room. Whatever, yeah. you know. But uh, so you go to the website there, MidtownGR.com, and show all the indoors, and that's how you get the the outdoor shows as well. Okay. Yeah. Awesome, Quinn. Thanks so much for being here. We're for looking forward me. to those shows. So yep. coming up, July, August, that outdoor piazza at Studio Park. You want tickets for those? Or the in-store shows? For all the things, MidtownGR.com. We'll be right back.